Welcome! In front of me I have Huawei Watch Fit 2 and I'm gonna show you how to measure the blood oxygen levels on this device. Before we start, a quick disclaimer. If you want to get the most accurate results of your measurements, make sure to put your watch on your wrist, secure it tightly so it doesn't move around, and while you're measuring your blood oxygen levels, try not to move too much. I'm just gonna put my finger on the sensor right here, but because of that my results might be not too accurate. Okay, so let's continue with the measurement. First thing you will need to do is to wake up the screen on your watch. And you can do it by pressing the side button. After you wake up the screen, press the side button again to open the menu. And in the menu you should see this icon. This is the SPO2 icon, the blood oxygen levels. Tap on it and you should see this menu. Now I'm gonna place my finger on the sensor and I, you can enable the, or rather start the measurement by tapping on the measure button right here. And after a couple of seconds, you should get your results. You can also tap on the test again button to repeat the test if you want to. Here we have a little graph uh, from whole day. So you can see the, uh, if you measure your heart rate or other blood oxygen levels throughout, throughout the whole day, you can see the stats right here on this graph. And you can also enable the automatic measurement if you want. To enable the automatic uh, oxygen level measurement, you need your, your watch needs to be paired with a phone uh, via the Huawei Health application. So, to enable the automatic measurement, tap or rather open the Huawei Health application on the phone that is paired with your watch. In the app, tap on devices, select the Huawei Watch Fit 2 from the list of devices, scroll down, tap on health monitoring. And here we have automatic SPO2. Tap on it. And now you can enable it by tapping on the switch, like this. You can also enable the low SPO2 alert. So uh, if you tap on this option, you can select the threshold. You can select 90, 85, 80, 75. Basically, if your uh, blood oxygen level uh, reaches a certain threshold or below it, you will be, the watch will alert you that your uh, levels are low, basically. So if I select 90, tap on OK, my, D, my low SPO2 alert will be at 90%. OK, and now your watch should measure the um, blood oxygen levels automatically. So if I put my, I don't know how often it does, but I believe it says it right here. While well, at rest, so basically when you're not moving around, uh, the watch will measure your uh, blood oxygen levels. Okay. So, you, if you're using the automatic one, you will get the whole graph right here. You will see the um, measurements throughout the whole day. Unle unless you want to do it manually, you can also do it manually by tapping on the measure button. Okay. And that's how you measure the blood oxygen levels on this device. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video.